Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I have been filming all day today a what I ate today. I'm 18 weeks and a half pregnant, so I am trying to up my vitamin and nutrient game for the sake of baby. I am not the healthiest eater, and I'm definitely trying to watch my weight with this pregnancy. It is our number three baby girl. She's due in May 2019. We're super excited to welcome her on board. So, like I said, I've been filming everything I've eaten today, every single meal from breakfast, lunch, dinner, all the snacks and small meals in between. A lot of the things are healthy and a lot of the things are not so healthy. The only two things that I've seriously been craving this pregnancy is cherry pop tarts and fresh raspberries. So, my appetite, except for those two things, are completely different and fluctuate on a day-to-day -day basis. Sometimes all I want to do is eat everything healthy and smoothies and fruits and yogurts and vegetables. And other days I want to eat chocolate cake and donuts. So I hope you enjoy this, what I eat in a day, being 18 weeks pregnant. I have more to come. If you're new, thank you so much for joining and I would love to have you subscribe to us. If you like this video, please hit the like button, thumbs up and I will see you guys next time. Bye. The first thing I do when I wake up is make myself a big tall glass of ice water, take my hair, skin, and nails gummies by Nature's Bounty, and um, take my prenatal vitamin. The hair, skin, and nails gummies was okayed by my doctor along with my prenatal. I have to take a prenatal over the counter instead of a prescribed one because the prenatals that I get prescribed make me super nauseous. My light breakfast, since I didn't really have an appetite this morning, was green juice, um, some Dave's Killer 21 grain bread, which is so good, I love it, and some almond butter. Super good, full of protein and fiber, and sometimes I will slice up a banana and put it on top, but I did not feel like slicing it, so I just ate the banana whole, bite for bite, bite of toast, and then a bite of banana. It was super good and yummy. So during lunchtime, I sometimes will have a huge meal. Today I had a light meal. This has like 10 ounces in it. It is a healthy choice cafe steamer. It is so good. It was a chicken margarita one. All you have to do is microwave it and then dump the top contents of the food into a super good yummy balsamic vinegar in the bottom and you mix it all together and it's a really good light fresh alternative meal if you do not feel like cooking. When I said my appetite is completely different throughout the day during this pregnancy, this is exactly what I meant. I'm eating some super buttery movie theater type butter popcorn. It was so good. I eat these bags like two times a week. They're super high in fat, but popcorn is a healthy snack. Um, you can probably minus all of the extra butter, but it was so good. One of my other snacks throughout the day, I love Granny Smith apples. Granny Smith are my favorite ones. And I just cut that up, left the skin on for extra nutrients. And I found this Wild Friends chocolate peanut butter protein at a local store called Grocery Outlet. They were like 50 cents, so I grabbed a few of them and it is so good. And you can't even taste the protein in it, but this snack here is filled with protein, fiber, and healthy fats. And of course, with any kind of almond butter or peanut butter, you stay full between meals. So that was a pretty good snack. My last big meal of the day is obviously gonna be dinner time and I'm gonna make some steamed broccoli with a little bit of salt and some baked salmon in the oven. Salmon is super good for the baby's eye development and brain while in your belly and it is packed with those fatty acids that are called omega-3 fatty acids and the way I made my salmon, you can make yours any way you want, but I like putting minced garlic. I would have put fresh garlic, but we didn't have any fresh garlic. So minced garlic, olive oil, some sea salt or regular salt, black pepper, and garlic salt. And it came out so good from the oven.
So while I just put my salmon in the oven, I am boiling some salted water and obviously this is not a boiling pan, but my boiling pan was dirty from the dinner the night before. So I just was super lazy this day and boiled my water in my fry pan. But the broccoli came out super tender and moist and it kind of steamed it up top with steam and then boiled it on the bottom with water. So I just eventually turned both of mine. But with every single meal and throughout the day, there is another big, huge glass of ice water. I drink ice water throughout the day. It keeps me hydrated, it keeps baby hydrated, and good fluids inside of my belly. I hope you enjoy this what I eat in a day being 18 weeks pregnant I have more to come every other week I will post a what I eat in a day being pregnant if you're new thank you so much for joining and I would love to have you subscribe to us and I will see you guys next time bye